I started trail building when I was 14 years old. It's something that you can have this giant canvas, which is the side of the hill, and you get to paint your own lines down it, see this land and see every corner and every jump. You can make it in your image and then other people love it too. My name is Max Farrick. I've been riding mountain bikes since I was like 11 years old, racing, traveling the world, doing enduro, downhill, cross country, and it's been pretty rad. When I was nine years old, I had the shin pain. I uh, went to the doctor and my dad had had Lyme disease before, so he demanded that they test me for Lyme. Tested positive. Within about a week, they gave me a dose of antibiotics. It was just such a low dose, it just didn't really do much for me. Got to the point where I was crawling around the house because my legs just wouldn't support the weight of my body. It was probably two months before I actually started seeing a specialist and getting the care I needed. Things I've dealt with over the last couple of years have been variety of fatigue, lung capacity, muscle fatigue, short-term memory loss, pretty serious mood swings. You know, it kind of affects both your mind and your body. It really takes at you emotionally when you're not able to do the things that you love at the capacity that you know you're capable of doing them. It's hard to stay positive when it feels like things are just coming down around you. Being able to get outside and you know breathe fresh air, feel the elements on you, changes your perspective. It always makes you feel better at the end of it. I've had this for over half my life now. It's hard to remember what being totally healthy is like. There's a lot of people out there who have so many different things going on and they're battling all their different issues. It gives me a much deeper sense of empathy for them and understanding that maybe you're dealing with what you're dealing with, but we can all go ride bikes and have fun together. It's really important to stay optimistic and stay positive about how you're doing and the minute you give in to the bad thoughts is when you stop fighting. As long as you keep fighting, you're gonna get healthier and get better.